everybody! Welcome back to A Glittery Life. You guys, I hope you're having the best day ever. I know I am having a really awesome day because I've got my good friend Kate, who is a celebrity nail artist, and I'm not sure the order of the videos, the way I'm putting them up, so you might already know this, but she is a really big deal here in Hollywood. She works on huge projects, including she recently was the nail artist for Taylor Swift's Bad Blood video. Talk about everybody in the industry who is fabulous getting to work on all of them at once that video is so sick so that's really cool she works on all kinds of celebrities um one of my favorite people that she works on who i just think is like miss glam herself is obviously j-lo and you know what listen i'm gonna link all of the information for her instagram down below so that you can check out some of her work and you can see uh, some people that she's worked on because you're gonna be super impressed i only bring you legit people right so Today's tutorial also includes an awesome giveaway. Look at this. I have teamed up with a London Town USA with their lacquer polish line. You use this in your kit. I do. I, I do. love, I love it. this. I'm new to this brand. I'm yeah. having so much fun with it. They were so generous to send over a bunch of stuff and five polishes for you guys. Uh, US only, I'll leave all the giveaway rules down in the drop down description as well as a link to London Town USA because you've got to check their stuff out. Reasonably priced, yeah. five free, which means that the five most toxic, craziest, worst ingredients for us, they checked them out. As Kate calls it, it's mommy friendly. Also gluten free, cruelty free, um, vegan, long last. That's a really fun giveaway. But to enter, you've got to be following, you need to be subscribed to this YouTube channel, obviously. And you need to be following both Kate and I on Instagram. I'll link our information down below. And if you don't have Instagram, you know I love you. Just leave me a comment telling me that you want to be entered and you know I'll do it. So anyway, enough about the giveaway, but that's super exciting. Kate. Tell us about this amazing manicure that you are doing a DIY for today. This is like my favorite, most favorite nail look that I've ever seen in my entire live long life. Well, I love negative space. Negative space is like the hot thing right now. And so I decided to create a look with liqueur's nail polish um, to just make like a fall look. It's just super cool and super hip and now and it's edgy. glittery. It's glittery and edgy all at the same time. <laughs> but I feel like you could wear this to a professional job and environment. And you know, listen, I'm not gonna insert a picture right now because I want you to watch the tutorial. So you'll have to see the finished look at the end because I know it's a little far away for you guys. But but this is my fall look. It's like my idea of a negative space look for fall. And it's so cool. It's so cool. So you guys keep watching and go ahead and leave me a comment down below um, if you love Kate as much as I do. And also if you want to see more videos like this because I think it's so fun. So if enough of you comment, we love Kate, <laughs> maybe she'll come back. So anyway, if you guys want to see this DIY, keep watching. We have prepped Trisha's nails with lacquer's nail hardener which is their base coat and now we're gonna go and start with the metallic half moons i love this brand too london town that's a new they're new to me i, I they're just new to me too i just started really great. yeah i just started using their stuff and i think it's so cute so i love all the colors they have and they have really cute names okay so just explain what you're doing right now so i'm taking just a tiny bit of polish maybe on the last 25 percent of the brush and I'm going towards the base of the nail, starting at one corner, I'm just doing one swoop across in the shape of a half circle. And you can go over a couple times, because it's kind of hard to get that perfect shape the first time for most people. And then you're gonna definitely get some polish on the cuticles, and don't worry about that. The next step is cleaning that up. So you're gonna take this cleanup brush here, dip it in some acetone, And just clean all of that polish you just got all over the skin around the cuticle. I'm gonna take a picture and I'll insert it right here for you guys. So you can see how cute my little half moons are. We could stop here and I'd be happy. That's what I was gonna say. This is like another super cute negative space look. You could totally wear this. I know you could, you could just put, put a top coat over this and that's a look. Look Seriously. At, you guys are even seeing me take the picture of the behind, you're getting the behind the scenes. So for this next step, we've set up 
the metallic moons and we're gonna go in with this beautiful gold glitter Britannia I think is how you pronounce it and I'm gonna use the other end of this cleanup brush which is kind of like a dotting tool and I'm just gonna scrape off a little bit of the glitter and apply that over the top of the metallic gold moons oh my gosh you make it look so easy it's so cute you guys I can't wait for you to see the finished look of this it's so cute Okay, so now we have the gold glitter over the half moons. So cute. Great combo. Woohoo! Once again, you could stop here and just have the cutest, like, negative space look. Totally. Okay, so what are you gonna do next? Now we're going to do some negative space. I mean, obviously, there's negative space here, but we're gonna. So tape explain off. what that means. Explain what negative space means. Negative space is with nail art at least, when you leave part of the actual nail exposed with whatever nail art you're doing. So some people, like this right now is a negative space nail look because you have only maybe 25% of the nail painted. And some people leave like a little square in the middle or like an open triangle and paint the outsides of the triangle. There's a lot of different ways to do it, so it's been this hot trend for the last year. Everyone's obsessed with using negative space, so this is going to be my take on negative space, and I love it. So it's basically just leaving empty space in the middle of your nail. Perfect. So for this next step, I'm going to take my nail tape to get it. So this is my nail tape. You can get this at any nail supply store. Again, I ordered some on Amazon. It yeah. was so cheap. So cheap on Amazon. Mm -hmm. Like, cents. So I got like 15 colors or something like that. Yeah. And it doesn't, with this, you're going to take it off. It's mm -hmm. just like a line for what we're going to do next. So I'm going to cut this into 10 different sections and then put it about halfway down Trisha's nail on each nail. And then we'll see the next step. Okay. <laughs> put the kettle on it's a really beautiful dark like slate gray what do you say it's like yeah it's a gray. beautiful slate gray perfect for fall totally perfect for fall and we're gonna paint the tips the edges of Trisha's nail and then we're gonna leave the middle part empty I can't wait to see how this is gonna turn out it's gonna be so cute free edges so at the tip of the nail once you paint at the top make sure to paint like this the underneath like the edge with this polish and one coat honestly is perfect actually so now we're gonna go through and carefully I'm gonna use my cuticle nippers to do this part carefully remove the tape and do it really slowly so you don't have to wait till it's dry no you don't have to wait till it's dry it's actually better to do it while it's wet oh, okay. for me at least I love doing it this way. So we only have one more step, which is gonna be our top coat. This already looks so cute. It's adorable. So we just finished with the top coat on Trisha's nails and these nails look so cute. I'm actually jealous. I know, I love them. And I will insert another photo for you guys so you can really see them. We can't get the camera to focus on them. Sorry. So we did the top coat and then I finished off her nails because she needed a little bit of moisture around the nail. <laughs> My cuticles are busted <laughs> is what she's trying to tell you. Busted. So this is their nourishing cuticle oil. It is amazing. It smells so great. It's like a light smell. I love it. I'm going to put it all over my hands. It's a little bit of an almond oil, like a sweet almond oil smell. Yeah, mm -hmm. a little bit. So that's the look.
I hope you guys like it. Okay, so thanks you guys so much for watching. I hope you loved this tutorial and leave me a comment if you want to see more of Kate in the future on a glittery life and do not forget to head over to my Instagram at Trisha Lee underscore W to enter to win this awesome London town USA lacquer giveaway and um, all the instructions will be in the drop down menu down below if you don't have an Instagram leave me a comment in the comment section telling me how much you love me and that you don't have an Instagram and I'll enter you anyway thanks you guys bye